Welcome back, this is Yamachak Tries with Learn Japanese to Survive Hiragana Battle. And that is uh, Nihongo and Kanji, I believe. I, I already know um, Hiragana to, uh, to at least a, a certain extent. I have been learning it. Uh, and this has been a game that... Oh my god, this is loud. We have to turn, we gotta turn the music down a little bit. Background music. Like, 60%. And uh, probably that as well. And then... I don't know. Are these sound effects or something? I don't know. We'll we'll, we'll do that. So this is a, this is a, a game that I got years ago because I wanted to learn Japanese, and um, I just never really played it. Now I know Japanese to a certain extent, so I'm kind of going to be uh, going with it. Uh, so we'll be reading the uh, the text. I'm going to try to read it in Japanese and in English, in the spirit of the game, because that's kind of what it's trying to teach me how to do, right? Uh, so this is Yo Koso, and welcome. This game is designed to teach you the very basics of Japanese hiragana. You'll learn how to read and write all of the hiragana characters during the course of your adventure. When your adventure is complete, you'll be ready to move on to more advanced Japanese studies. For now, let's begin. It's a cute little game. It's like a JRPG kind of thing, but with uh, with like Japanese typing elements or something like that. Brr, it's cold, but it's a beautiful evening. Claire, what are you doing out here? Get out of the snow. Eric, I'm heading to the tavern. Got to get the chill out of my bones. I'll join you. Come on. Mash in the space bar. <laughs> ah, it's lovely and warm in here. Much better than being buried in snow, right? Haha, you know how I am. I can't resist admiring the night sky. You haven't changed much these past few years, Claire. Neither have you, Eric. It's good to know I can always count on you to come looking for me. You bet. Let's have a drink. Cheers. Cheers. Reminds me of really poorly made, like, uh, yeah, old school JRPGs. Hello! Er, ah, it's Leon. Hi, mind if I join you for a drink? Uh, Leon, weren't you, weren't you kicked out of the village? Oh, yeah, yeah, that was just a small misunderstanding. The elder thought I stole his prized pumpkins, but I didn't. I didn't steal them. It's all behind us now. We had a good old laugh about it before. <laughs> but... But you baked pumpkin pie and gave it to everyone in the village. Exactly! That's baking, not stealing. <laughs> ah, it's good to be back. Oh boy. Such a beautiful day. Clear skies, pure white snow all around. Simply wonderful. Since I have some errands, I better not tarry. Where should I go first? Over to this edgy edgemeister. Okay, he's not wearing a, a thing, he's just bearded. <laughs> I thought he was wearing, like, a, a bandana over his face or something. Excuse me, miss, may I have a moment? A stranger? Never seen him before. Hello, sir, how can I help you? Tell me something, do you understand me when I say... Uh, konnichiwa? Or, no, I'm sorry, I didn't catch that. I did catch that. That's too bad. Uh, 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 that's ah ha ha ha. What's with this guy? What's this strange language he's speaking? Farewell. Uh, that is Sayonara. Ugh, magic? I can sense he's up to evil. I need to follow him. Ha 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 ha. It's too easy to conquer tiny nations like this. There's no resistance. Oh no, is that Leon? No, that's a random guard, I think. A random person. Stop! Haha, <laughs> why? You can't, you can't do this. I don't see anybody trying to stop me. You couldn't stop me even if you tried. Urgh, I'll wipe that smug look off your face. And we have to go type here to Ghana. Question mark. That's not at all what he looks like. What are you doing? You're awfully brave, girl. However, you can't lay a finger on me. If you can't even understand Japanese, you can't hope to dispel my magic. Japanese? Is he talking about the weird words he spoke before? Let's see what you can do against my Hiragana warriors. Question mark, question mark, question mark. Summoned any allies. Enemy Hiragana... A Warrior strikes, that is the A uh, and E. Uh, we're gonna fight. You know what? I'll, uh, I'll get my, my controller out for this one just so that we get less mashing of. Um... Hopefully, the controller works after I just plug it in. Yeah, it works. Alright. It's backwards, though. I got it. Uh, no, it's not backwards, but. I, uh, I like the right button on my controller to be the A button, and then the, the bottom button to be the B button. That's just kind of how I'm used to it, but 
It's backwards. We're going to attack. Uh, e did more damage to us, so we'll go hit E. Huh? Did it tell me to attack off? Goodbye. Now, sayonara. 378 damage, he's overpowered. There's nobody else in my way. This village is as good as conquered. It's time to move on to the next helpless village. Ha 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 ha. I can't believe he's so strong. He said to defeat him, I need to learn Japanese. Hmm. I'm really hoping this isn't like a super weeby game and it's like actually fun, but we'll see. Several weeks have passed since the dreadful events in the village. Claire, our heroine, Heron? Heroine? Our drug has spent countless hours helping rebuild the village. The mysterious Japanese mage left many of his hiragana warriors roaming the lands for around the village. Claire's come up with a plan to defeat them. Okay, everybody, today is the day we begin to fight back against the hiragana warriors. I have spent a long time researching this Japanese language that we need to learn in order to dispel the mage's magic power. Once we start learning the language, we can begin to defeat the hiragana warriors that have invaded the land. I sent a letter to the capital asking for help with our challenge. The Great Library is sending one of their best scholars to aid us. Ah, it looks like she just arrived. Don't worry, I got this on wrap. Hello, you must be Misaki. I'm Claire. It's great to meet you. Of course she's Japanese. Nice to meet you, Claire. I have been informed about your situation. Thank you for coming to help me. Us? I can't remember what it said. You're very welcome. As you have probably heard, I am Japanese, just like the strange mage that caused the damage here. Please don't think we are similar. In truth, he is an evil magician named Nobudo. My people have been trying to defeat him for generations. As you have gathered, the only way to destroy the Hiragana warriors is he summons is using knowledge of the Japanese language. This is a lot of text before we can play the game. Starting today, I will be your Japanese teacher. Thank you. Please teach us everything you know. Gladly. Firstly, let's head inside somewhere warm. Actually, I'm probably going to need keyboards to type, right? No worries. I don't want to see this town in trouble ever again. I'll learn Japanese and take down every single one of those Hiragana warriors. Thanks, Eric. I knew I could count on you. You can count on me, too, you know. I want to learn Japanese and travel to Japan in the future. Good idea, Leon. Japan is an amazing place full of beautiful scenery and wonderful people. And lovely ladies, I bet. Jeez, Leon. Keep focused. Okay, attention, please. Firstly, I'm going to give you a rundown of what we'll be learning. Please pay attention. You want to make sure you have a notebook and pen handy. Taking notes is the first step to success. That means you, player. Go get a pen and notebook. I'll be waiting. Now, an introduction to language. Um... Yeah, I already explained this in my last KF2 episode. No, not my last one, but I think the one before the last one. No, the last one? I don't know! Hiragana is the basic set of characters, and by using Hiragana you can form almost any sentence in Japanese. We'll be focusing our efforts on Hiragana during your adventure. The other two character sets are a bit different. Katakana is used almost exclusively to represent words from foreign languages, as well as names. Um, but names also use kanji. Kanji is a complex character set borrowed from Chinese picture symbols. Kanji is quite advanced, but learning it is very rewarding. This is true. Back to Hiragana. There are 46 basic Hiragana characters, and each one is used to represent a unique sound or syllable. You can also make an additional 25 Hiragana characters by adding small strokes to specific characters. There's also, like, circle ones. Um, they're called diacritics. And we will learn this as we go. Learning a new language can be daunting. If you begin to feel overwhelmed, take a break and come back with a refreshed mind. With persistence and bravery, you can learn all the hiragana. Remember to take lots of notes as we go, revise your notes every day, and you'll soon commit all the hiragana to memory. I will go through each character individually and teach you how to write it and pronounce it. And at the end of this chapter, we'll have a quiz. Do your best. After the quiz, we'll travel outside the village to fight some hiragana warriors. I was hoping to be more gameplay stuff, honestly. The first five characters are known as short vowels. These short vowels are A, I, U, E, O. You can, say that I've you can see that I've written them above. Let's go through them one by one. A. Ah. Ah. You want me to actually write it? Okay. Okay. You you concerned me for a moment there. I know how to write it. One more time. Yeah, yeah. Can we can I skip this? I was hoping we'd have more gameplay elements. Uh we will just continue with the lesson. E E E It's like a little wa pa and a little wa. That's how I, I'm like, you know in the in shows and stuff, you got the characters, you're like, you just gotta give it a little hua and a little ka and a little shu chum. You know, that's, that's me, that's how I, that's, that's how my brain works. <laughs> so that, that, the first one is a little wa-pa, and the next one is a little wa. This is u. You see that the font changes when they, uh, when they show it to you, and then the, um, see how it kind of looks different? Um... Kind of, kind of, kind of looks different. Um, 
it changes, right? Like, it's still the same thing. And uh, that, like, um, font difference, like, you'll see it with this one as well when they uh, when they show it. It'll look very, very different. Um, because uh, that, that font difference is, um, is actually really confusing as a learner. Um, I'm past it personally at this point. I can pretty much read any font for the most part. Some of them are kind of weird, like, especially handwriting. Um, but... I don't need to like I'm I'm just skipping this stuff because it's it's garbage. I wanted more I wanted more uh, more um, more gameplay elements. Honestly, that's what I was kind of looking forward to. And then uh, it's really putting a focus on the the learning how to. Oh no, please uh, save to this file. Good, I think. It seems like a lot's taken. Yes, I've given you quite a bit of information to remember. The best thing to do is to practice writing and saying the characters out loud. Be sure to get the pronunciation perfect as it will play a big part in forming Japanese words. Honestly, the hardest part in, uh, in Japanese speaking is to, like, pitch accent. Misaki, I have a couple of questions. Yeah, me too. I'm happy to answer your questions before we do a quiz. What do you want to know? Because pronouncing each individual character is not that hard, like a i u e o but, like, getting the, the pitch accent on it is honestly the hard part when you're actually, like, saying a word or a sentence. I'm happy to answer your questions before we do a quiz. What do you want to know? Well, so far we have learned five characters, but it doesn't seem like I can make any Japanese words using these letters yet. What gives? Well, the letters we have all we have learned are all vowels. In order to start making Japanese words, we'll have to learn some consonants as well. You'll learn some next sense lesson. Misaki, I'm having trouble writing the characters out. They're way different from English letters. What should I do? Practice makes perfectly on the order of the strokes is probably the most important part of writing. Later on, you'll be able to review this lesson, so watch the animations once more and memorize the order of the strokes. Any more questions, guys? All good, Claire. Thanks, Misaki. Great, let's move on to our first quiz. Eep. I need to quiz you on what you've learned before I send you out to fight Hidagana Warriors. Make sure you're ready. Okay, here we go. Question one. What is this character? That is A. Ah. Correct. Well done. What is this character? That is E. Eh. Correct. Well done. What is this character? That is an U. And that is, uh, that is O right there. And this one will be E. Good job, everyone. Hit easy. I'm proud of you all. I think you're ready to challenge the Hidagana Warriors in battle. The Hidagana Warriors are ending the village are fairly weak. Using the knowledge you now have, I'm confident you can defeat them. It's a lot of reading! I just wanted to play games! We'll go after the bigger and stronger Hidagana Warriors after future lessons. One step at a time. Let's do this. Everybody follow me to the village outskirts. Alright, bring me to a game. Yeah. Let's move the characters, use the arrow keys. Move forward, back, left, and right. If you want to use the WSD keys... Yeah, 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 yeah. I know how to move. I know how to save a game. Not really, but okay. So it's uh, it's tile based. We got a u o. Yeah, no, Eric, Leon, be careful. We're gonna do no damage, and then we're gonna be like, we have to, we have to say it, or say what it is, or something. Oh no. What do we do, Misaki? Stay calm. Listen carefully to my instructions and we'll be able to take down this one. I think this one down would be better. In order to defeat Hiragana Warriors, we have to use our Japanese knowledge to hit them with their matching letter or character. For example, we're fighting against the character A right now. That means you need to hit it with the English equivalent character. Hmm, that's the letter A, right? That's it. When it's our turn to attack, select English from the command menu. Then find the right letter to use and select it to attack. If you get the right answer, you damage the enemy. If you get the wrong answer, the enemy won't take any damage. You have to keep hitting the enemy with the correct answer in order to defeat it. Got it. Let's do it. Yeah, 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 just let me play the game. Let's go with a little bit of fight, we're gonna go with an answer, this is an ah, on ah, and then we're gonna go with an answer, ah, on ah. Look at all that damage. Oh, look at this gameplay. It's the first one, so it's nice and easy. Alright, we get 78 XP or something. Good job, good job! But Eric and Leon, they got captured by those Hiragana warriors. Let's go after them, they can't have gotten very far. Okay, let's explore the forest and find them both. There's no time to waste. Claire, take these before they go. What, huh? What are these funny-shaped bottles? These are popular drink in Japan. Drink one of these ramen to destroy your to restore your health points. Don't be afraid to use it in a pinch. If one of the us falls in battle, use one of these revives. So bring us back to the fight and restore some HP. Ramune. You can find these in any other items you find during battle, or you can... Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. So, uh, Ramune, how do I open the item? Oh, we don't have, like, a picture of it. I think Ramune are those really weird-looking bottles. Those really, really weird-looking bottles, right? And 
and uh, probably have to take out both of them on this guy. This is A and E, by the way. In case you can't remember. In case you're still new to the whole... Okay, cool. So we can go ahead and just attack you. Ah, uh, this should probably kill it, so we'll take out A as well. I like this game. I, uh, I wish I played it earlier because it probably would have actually made a um, notable difference to my, uh, my understanding of Japanese. I wouldn't say this is the best way to learn Japanese, but um, like you find it fun. I mean, go for it, right? It's better than not learning Hitagana if you want to learn Japanese, right? Like you're obviously better off to, uh, to do something than nothing, right? Read this? No. Got some ruins up here. What's going on with all this? Wait, we can't leave until we find Eric and Leon. I wanted to check out the ruins. This is A and O. Once you get into uh, like uh, Katakana and Kanji, it starts to get a lot more complicated because um, some of them are kind of similar, but then just different. You know. And uh, that kind of gets in the way, especially once you start adding in diacritics and all that as well. That can really mess you up because like a ka turns into ga, and uh, it's just a diacritic on it, so it's uh, kind of hard to see at times. And you're like Kessiner? Oh, Desiner! Oh, I understand. I understand. The ones that really get me are the, uh, the ha, and the ho, and the he, because those uh, those have two diacritics, the circle and then the little the little two strokes, which turn into like, bo and po. Ah, uh, yeah, it's the diacritics that turn into bo, and then the, the circle that turns into po, I believe. Um, but those ones kind of mess me up particularly badly. Yeah, this totally would have uh, been actually like helpful. Oops, no, this totally would have been actually helpful to me if I was um, like learning Hiragana. I used realkana.com or studykana or something like that for uh, for studying my kanji and my uh, my kana. Anyway, um, that worked pretty well for me. So you're captured by those Hiragana warriors. Lucky we managed to find you. Blast! That's awkward. Are you okay? Are you injured? I'm a little bruised. Hurt my arm a bit. We'll take it slow. You hang back for now. Claire and I will take care of any foes we encounter. All right. Hey, thanks for rescuing me. No sweat. Let's go. I want to. Can I investigate things? Can I like pick things up out of these? No. Okay. That's fine. No. Hey, I wanted to attack E, not A. This was a misclick. Okay, fine. You'll each take out your own. Okay, so you're gonna go ahead and stop, and you can attack A. I guess I should take him up from the back first, just so that I don't do that as often. That might be the most sensible. That might be the most sensible. For sure. Let's see, where's the, uh, where's the other boy? I can't even remember his name. Ooh, up here is... I'm into JRPGs in general, and this one, uh, it feels fine. I mean, the you, you look at the, the things as basically being like a weakness, right? Like, the Ooh character is weak to the, the Ooh type of... The, the Ooh element, you know? <laughs> kind of thing. And, uh... It's just kind of like using the weakness against the uh, the enemies, except the uh, the weakness is the English, like, roma D version of the, um, of the character. Or later on, perhaps words. Uh, this will probably take it out, so we'll take you out. <coughs> Excuse me. It's kind of cool. I'm into it. I don't know if I'll end up like beating it. I mean, I might. It's probably not that long. 
Hey, butt kick, that's what happened. How embarrassing. Do you feel okay? Are you hurt? I'm a little hurt. My leg is killing me. We'll take it slow. You hang back for now. Claire and I will take care of any foes we encounter. Oh god, my voice. Hold up, any water. Okay, thanks for coming to find me. I owe you one. Don't mention it. Let's go. Looks like everybody's okay. Thank goodness, but there's still a few Hidagana warriors that clear out around here. We should head to the forest exit north of here and check out what enemies are beyond. Okay, let's make our way north and defeat enemies on the way. Eric and Leon, hang back and watch how we do it. we Will do. Roger. Can I run? Oh, you, you can totally run. I haven't been running. I can be running. This is an amazing revolution. We got a little bit of eh. And a more eh. Look at that damage. Look at that huge damage. And this is an E. 60s? 74! Whoa! I guess they have like 100 health probably. That's my guess. Alright, we can run. We can run! Game breaking bug right here. Okay, yeah, we can just take you out nice and easy. We are so powerful. We're also like kinda getting hurt, but not not badly enough to be uh, to be a problem. Unless the forest takes it up ahead, then we made it. There are much stronger Hiragana warriors outside the forest. It seems like we've taken care of the remaining Hiragana warriors around here. What do we do now? We need to learn a bit more before we escape the dangers outside the forest. Let's head back to town, regroup, and get ready for another study session. Great idea. I can't wait to learn even more. Yeah, save my progress. Do you have your notebook and pen ready? We're gonna learn a second set of Hiragana characters. There's five new characters learning this lesson. It's gonna be the toes. Tease. I'll go through each character individually and teach you how to write it and pronounce it. At the end of this chapter, we'll have a quiz, so do your best. Yeah, no, this is the uh, the cause. The characters we are learning in this lesson are Kaki, Ku, Ke, Ko. Notice how these are similar to our vowel sounds. You pronounce these syllables the same way with a hard K in front. I'll pronounce each one as you go. Yeah, 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 yeah. Can I skip this somehow? I'm, I'm going to pause this as we go through this. Um, I don't know. I want to I do some more gameplay. I know. Key, key. It's key, I know. You got the. It's like a saw, but with an extra little bit on it. See how it's like super different? It's the. Uh, it's like uh, the serifs for, uh, for Japanese. Ku. It's Ku. I remember this because it looks like kind of like Pac Man. Why does that help? I don't know. Remember this because it looks like T. Again, why does it help? I don't know. It's just the way my brain works, yo. Please. Allow me to. Yeah, it's Ko, I know. This one can also be like connected there sometimes, so it's like completely connected. Kind of messes you up sometimes. And then Toe kind of looks similar to this too sometimes. Like handwritten stuff. Oh, it's super bad. The doc ten or ten ten. Doc ten are little symbols that look like the above image. These are what are these little characters used for? Well, when you add them to another Hiragana character, you can make an entirely new sound. Yeah, so kad ga. Told you. I told you. Ga. 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 No, I don't. Please. Please. Just bring me to the... I know I know this stuff. Great lesson today. I hope you've all taken a bit of information from this. Sure did, Misaki. Thanks to you, I know way more hiragana than before. I really like those Doc 10 marks. Who knew it would sound so... Who'd be, who knew it would be so easy to turn one sound into another? If we count all the hiragana we know now, including ones with Doc 10, we know 15. That's 15 different Japanese characters. Blah, blah. I'm so glad you're all enjoying the lesson, but now it's quiz time. Question one. What is this character? Cole. Correct. Well done. What is this character? Ke. What is this character? Gi. Ka. And Ge. That one. Yeah, okay, we're gonna go to the weapon shop. Oh my goodness, we got a weapon shop? Let's, uh, what are you? Yeah, that makes sense. Um, this is the weapon shop down here. Welcome. Ever since Dangerous Heat of Gone Warriors were started roaming the land, I've set up shop in this village selling weapons and armor for protection. If you see anything you like, please let me know. Let's buy a Bokuto. Let's buy a Bokuto. 
I mean, I guess we could. Um, I kind of like the Bokuto. Yeah, I'll buy the Bokuto. And Claire's already kind of like a beast, right? So you may as well be extra powerful as Claire. And then uh, we'll just... I just want to go. I just want to go. I don't want to go. I don't want. I don't want. I don't want to be dealing with all this. I just want to go. World map, head north. Blah blah blah. Yeah yeah. Please allow me. Allow me to experience some more gameplay. Some more. Oops. Some more of this amazing gameplay. I wanna. I wanna. I wanna go to. I wanna go to the end game place. Why do you need to this place is super boring? It maybe it's boring in the past, but now it's full of dangerous Hitagana warriors. It's best that we stay alert. You read my mind, Claire. We'll clear out the Hitagana warriors as we go. By the way, if you're in a hurry, you can dash by moving the shift key while moving. Oh, one more thing. If you're low on HP or someone has been knocked unconscious, return to town and stay at the end. We'll restore us back to full health. Are we low on health right now? No, we're good. We're good. Let's head up uh, over here. I know where they... Oh, no. I was going to try and go up over this way to see if we can get some, some stuff, but... Um, Oh my god, there's so many. There's so many. I know what they are, it's just like finding them in this thing. It's like... I wish I could just type it in, you know? Oh my god, it's gonna be so... When you know all of them, you're gonna have to like... Oh, that's gonna be horrible. Uh, actually, you know what we should do is probably... Um, go for like some of this as well, right? Uh, and then go on this guy as well, I guess. Sure. Sure. This might work. Maybe? I don't know. We'll either take them both out this turn, or we'll take them both out next turn. Either way. It's fine by me, right? Yeah, so next turn. Unless the gods are... Like... Stronger or something? Maybe? I don't know. They do not appear to be stronger. Well, more defensive... No more health, anyway. So that's fine. Pain to buckle. Oh, you know, I should probably go and equip the, uh... Bokuto, the buckler is equipped. Equip. Claire. You get a, uh... Don't, no, you're, no, you're, you're not Claire. You, you're, uh, hold up. Misaki. Take the Bokuto. And uh, Buckler. Yeah, Misaki, you're a little bit, you're a little bit extra strong now. Can I slash that? No, that's okay. We got a Ka. Where's Ka? All right, you're dusted. You're dusted. Look at that damage. Look at that damage. All right. I want to fight a boss or something, you know? Like, give me a word to fight. As long as we can build a solid bridge. Well, if you know how, I'll give you a hand sword. And let's hunt around with some strong logs. Three good logs should be enough. Where to look? Uh huh. A forest conveniently located on the other side of the bridge. I want this chest. It's a mimic. We got a gi and a gay. Gay. I think it's gay, right? I don't know. <laughs> Pronunciating stuff is uh, is not my strong suit, as I've mentioned before. But after this fight, I think that's gonna be a good time. Not really a good time, but the time that uh, that we have to end it. I mean, uh, can't go on forever, right? Every 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 good thing's got to come to an end eventually. Uh, you are gay, and you are gay as well. Alright. Yeah, so that's gonna do it for today. Um, honestly? Oh, that's, a uh, N, too. Nice. The money! Oh, yeah, no, wait, we gotta, we gotta point that out. So I just, I just realized that the money, down at the bottom left, is, a uh, 15, 13 yen. It's kind of N, but... Be like um what is it uh 
2513年。どうもだ。Anyway, that is going to do it for today.、Uh, if you liked the video, then、uh, go ahead and hit the like button. Actually,、uh, this is gonna, that's going to do it for today. If you,、uh, if you wanted to learn Japanese, how much is this game? How much, how much is that? It's $7.79 Canadian.、Uh, so I'm going to guess it's like $6.50 American or something like that.、Um, it seems like a, a pretty fun game, honestly.、Uh, if your goal is to learn Japanese and you wanted to play a game while you did it. Yeah? I mean, it doesn't get better than this. Um, it's not really how I would recommend learning Japanese personally, but not how I did it. So, like, literally not how I would recommend it. It's not what I did.、Um, but, I mean, it's a fun little game. If you wanted to, to learn your hiragana, then it's fine.、Um, yeah. I don't, I don't think there's anything particularly wrong with this. It's not super weeby, it's,、uh, it's genuinely pretty educational.、Um, they add in some kanji here and there for you to learn, kind of like the. I mean, The symbol for money is right there, right? That's kind of nice.、Um, it's kind of mixed in amongst stuff where you just kind of pick up that that is the symbol for money, right? And、um, yeah, it's kind of just nice.、Um, the, the UI is a little bit, you know, eh? But、uh, yeah, all in all, I think that、um, like, it's good. It's fine. Um, I would recommend it if you, if you wanted to learn Japanese and, and want to play a game while you're doing it.、Um, that's g o o n do it for today. Thank you for watching. Remember to like, do it if you like, and subscribe to see more of the future comment if you have anything to say, and I will see you next time. Bye bye.